Yeah, that's what they say. So it's like everything you just lay from the say when you come to the right time. Yeah, I said those things. So let me read what Solomon say. They say Solomon interrogates but all law sabu again a land of his activity. So the devil has activities, he got power, he got activities, activities. He got authorities. He got authority. He got authorities. He got authority of the earth because while the earth is given to the hand of the wicked, the devil, and then the devil got people, the red devil, the red people, the red Edomites. Alright. Yeah, who I chose Jacob. Yeah, who I chose Yakub. The devil chose the white people. Or we said the so-called white people, but we're gonna come out of the end now. In, the, in, the, in, the, in this age that we're not going to say white people anymore because we are the real white people. All right. We got white heart. That means our deeds is white. We got a light. We have Yahushua. But they are the real black people because they got black heart and yellow teeth. Even us from Africa, from the land of Kenya, we don't have two brushes all the way in the back, back, back. And in the interiors but the place is peaceful everybody get along in Africa people get along a lot of people get along everybody get along in Africa but we're not we're not violent people we're not violent people we are peaceful we love nature we can live in nature and don't believe when people say it's all mud house in Africa that we were swinging from tree to tree that's a lie the white men they were the red men to you there you saw the devil tell you that the Africa is poor, Africa is miserable, Africa need help. Oh, let help the Africans. They help the Africans. They help them. They need help. Let give them food. They are starving. You saw, it's a propaganda. You saw tell you that Africa is poor, Africa is not developed, Africa is this, Africa is that, Africans are this. And then they go behind your back. And they go steal the riches, the gold, the diamond, the cocoa, the rice, the gold, the diamond, the zinc, the iron ore, the ruby, the cobalt, because there's a lot of cobalt in, 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 your, in Congo. Congo has a lot of mineral. Liberia have a lot of minerals. Africa is where I'm from. They got a lot of elephants. You can literally see the elephants walking on the street. Right. We got a lot of pineapples, we got a lot of corn, we got a lot of rice. Africa is rich in everything. And that's why the land is part of the land that yet we give to our ancestors. And when we go there, you will know that. All right. The day we step our foot in that land, you will know that that's really our land. All right. We, most of my brothers, my so called African American brothers, my Haitians brother, my Caribbean brothers, they are, they are always saying Africa, Africa. They keep asking me, how is the land of Africa? All right. They go, they can say, how is the motherland? I want to go like they want to go visit. They want to go take a trip. They want to go see for themselves. They want to go the year that the place is nice. The place is not like how the word, the red man, the enemy, are deceived into thinking that Africa is poor. Africa is not developed. Africa does not have no riches. But the white man, the red man tell you that the enemy, and then you go behind your back to go steal the gold, the diamond, the silver. You go steal our women. You go steal the cocoa. You go steal the rice. You go steal the medicine because every 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 medicine that you need is in Africa. Every medicine you need come from the earth, come from the trees. All right. You eat. You eat to be healed. All right. Our food is our medicine. What we eat is our medicine. All right. The, the herbs that we eat is our medicine, but it's a you start demonize everything, and then you go behind your back, and then you go steal it. So that's proof that Esau is the devil, all right? And Yahushua is coming to destroy the devil. And we're going to meditate terror on the devil because judgment is going to be given to, into our hands. So, so we that have been oppressed, going to oppress the devils, all right? But I read the Testament of Solomon. And let me show you a quick picture of. Of Africa, how beautiful the place is. All right, and 
this is where I'm from. It's called Africa's Côte d'Ivoire. Because that you got a lot of elephants. You can literally see the elephant working, not in the city, but in the towns. You can see a lot of elephants. We got a lot of we got a lot of ivory. That's what we say, Ivory Coast. Just like they got a gold coast in, in Ghana, which is Negro land. They got a gold coast. We got the Ivory Coast, and then we got, we got Liberia, the Pepper Coast, which all the lands, they are the same place. All right, they just split, called by different names. It's just how he saw the enemy, he scattered us, and devoured us. Our people that stay in Africa, he called the Africans, and then them that were brought here, the same people that were brought here, he called the Africans, Americans. So it's a great division because why? When Africans and African African American, when they realize they are the same people, they're gonna stop all that beef, all that bullshit between Yahuwada, between Judah and Ephraim, all that are gonna stop. Alright. That beef between Judah and Ephraim, the North Neutral and the South Neutral, they're gonna stop. Because you are gonna gather us. We're gonna be brothers again. So they take Africa is not developed, but this is Africa's Cote d'Ivoire or Liberia. All right. All right. Let me show you something else. This is Cote d'Ivoire. I was born right here. Where it's a taboo. That's where I was born. Which Africa is the same, it's the same as Liberia. It's the same, it's the same Negro land. Negro land is Ghana, Africa, Liberia, Guinea, Ghana, Burkina Faso, Mali, or Sierra Leone, Togo, Benin. Those are Negro land. Judah, Levi, Samir, Asher, Naphtali, Benjamin, they live in those places. All right. And our people, they are still over there. And yeah, we're going to, okay, this is, why was, this is why I was born here. Why I said here. Written taboo. That's what I was born. <laughs> Alright. And this is why yeah, what people are scattered. Alright. Seven eight seven eight chapter three, nine to ten. This is the Nile River. The Nile River and the blue now. And then all these countries. Western. Sudan, South Africa, Demo Democratic Republic of Congo, CAR, Central Republic of Africa, Chad, Congo, Tanzania, Kenya, Liberia, Guinea, Mali, Sierra Leone, Togo, Benin, Chai, all these places, yet what people are scattered beyond the river of Kush, beyond the Ethiopian river. Our people are scattered over there, and yet we are going to cause the people to move again. We are going to cross this river, we are going to go to Yedin, Southern Arabia, Etria, Jordan, Iraq, Yashuri, or Israel, the Middle East, and every region in India. That is our land. We're gonna go back. We're gonna go back over there. All right. So the people cross. The people cross. You see, if you look at Africa, they cross the Middle Passage. There's small road between the cross and the go to go to all these countries to go to, to, to all these African countries. All right. And yeah, let me show the map that I found that I show our territory of where our land is. All right. All right. The whole place is like circle. In red and beyond, it's our land. All right. From Egypt, Sudan, part of Sudan, it's our land. Part of Ethiopia, it's our land. The whole of Middle East is our land. Reaching all the way, even some part of India, it's our land. Because in the book of Adam and Eve, they talk about how the rivers in India, where there's a lot of snakes, they mention a lot of snakes, which India has the most snakes. Reaching all the way to India, some part of India, it's our land. And you're going to see that when we go to our land, we go out. There's 12 tribes, 
each tribe have their own land. Each tribe is a nation by itself. So the land is not just that piece of that piece of Jerusalem, that just piece of the city. Right? They're just piece of the city. But it's so high everything. Africa might even be, be big on America. Africa might, might even be big in America, but it's so high everything. It's just a serpent. It's another disguise things. This is why we need a rock or dash so we can prove all things. And this is the cruel people, which the people are the Levites, and this one, they are the children of Levi and Judah. Right? The people got refused to enslave the they, they refused to be captured, which they live in Liberia and Africa, the cruel people, which are the Levites. All right. When you hear about the, 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 the Haitian, Haitian Revolution, these are the people. The Haitian Revolution, those are the Levites, the, the children of Yahuwah, that because cruel people and global people live together. Basa people and Kwan people. Who call them the Basa and the Kwan? The cruel, the global people. These are the it's like just a Judah and Levi. So when you have the Haitian Revolution, the killing the slave masters, we don't play no game. All right. There's like the same people as called the Creole people. The Creole, the crew, crew, Creole. We speak, we speak the crew language. All right. We speak crew. We speak crew, which is our language. All right. We speak Creole. We are in Sierra Leone. We are in Ghana. We are scattered in the West Indies. We are in America as well. <laughs> All right. So that's a piece of history. All right. So our people are scattered. They are scattered all in the places from beyond the river of Kush. All the countries in the in the African in the African countries we are scattered in all the places, and yet we're gonna gather us from over there and take us back to our land. So we're scattered beyond the river of, of Kush, of Ethiopia. All right. And that's in front of Zephaniah. And this is the passage of how we came. We came for Jerusalem. We cross, all right. We cross in a little passage from Jerusalem to Africa. There's a lot of passage. There's a lot of rule. And we took that rule and we we'll enter into West Africa. Beyond the river of Kush, and after we're taking, we're scattering everywhere. And everywhere we are, we're going to be gathered from there. Example of how the, how the earth is from above the earth. All right. Our temple was destroyed, so now we're going to worship Yahuwah in our body as individuals, as brothers and sisters. As, as an assembly, we are the people that were sold. We came on ship, we're gonna live by chariots. <laughs> All right. In Africa, is rich with everything cocoa, gold, diamonds, minerals, emerald, silver, gemstone, all type of gemstone is in Africa. Our people are scattered everywhere. All right. Africa was our base, which was the mountain that Yahushua prophesied we should flee, we should flee to. We flee to Africa. That means the people a little walk from our land to Africa. So it was, it's a walking distance. And that's when the northern tribe the day they walk from Jerusalem in the past, they went to Africa. And yeah, still there. Yahuwada is still in Africa because I am from Africa. All right. So I represent. So when somebody say, when I'm in Africa, I will stand up. This is what big Jew that teaching that no people in Africa, that this is the land. So that's why I stood up. I stood up to his face. So I'm going to be his adversary. He's my brother, but I'm going to be his adversary when he speak against the truth. Either you're working for Yahushua or you are against Yahushua. And I am for Yahushua, so I'm not afraid to speak to nobody. Yahushua empower, empower me to speak to everybody and to speak against everybody that comes against Yahushua. So I'm not afraid of nobody. Just like Ali Yahu was not afraid of nobody. So I'm not afraid of nobody as well. I come in the spirit of Ali Yahu and Dawi. 
These are the two spirits we are praying for, Ali Yahu and Dawi. So, <laughs> don't play with me. I'm a mighty man in Yahuwa, in Yahushua. Let me read this real quick before the film go off. Go off. The testament of Solomon. It says Solomon interrogates but all Sabu, Lord Sabu again in line of his activities. Then I summon, then I summon but all Sabu to appear before me again. When he was seated, I thought it was appropriate to ask him, Why are you the prince? Why are you alone the prince of the demons? So saying, the devil God is the prince of the demons. He replied, Because I'm the only one left of the heavenly angels who fell. The evening star is the devil. You see that big star in the night is the devil star. Which they call Venus. Venus is not a planet, but Venus is a star, which is the devil. Why are you are you alone the prince of the demons? He replied, Because I'm the only one left of the heavenly angels who fell. I was the highest ranking angel in heaven. You see that very big star in the night? That's the devil. It's very big, very bright. He's bigger than most of the stars. That's the devil star. You look we look up right now. Or in the night when it's that big star that close to the moon, I believe it's the second to the moon. That's the devil star. That means the devil lives in a star. It stands still, but it's actually moving. Alright. I seen it. It's a star that is standing still, but it's moving to and fro. The spirit, all the spirit in a star is moving. Alright. Why why are you alone the prince of demons? He replied, because I'm the only one left of the heavenly angels who fell. I was the highest ranking angel in heaven. So there was 72, there were 73 mighty ones, and Satan, the devil, God, he's the mighty one. He's the prince of this world. This world, this world the people in this world, they worship God. Because God is the devil, God is the mighty one of this world. He's the mighty one of Esau. When the devil fall, Esau is going to fall. I was the highest ranking angel in heaven, the one called Boazabu. They also accomplished me another unrighteous monarch whom yet were cut off and now now cut off and now in prison yeah. He hold in his power the race of those bound by me in Tartarus, which is talking about Azizu. He is being nurtured in the Red Sea. And when he is ready, he will come up, he will come in triumph. Alright. Revelation chapter 9, Azizu is gonna be losing from the balance pit. And the angels under him, the locusts like angels, are going to torture those that do not believe in Yahuwah, those that do not believe in Yahushua. That's going to happen very quick. I said to him, What are your activities? He replied, I bring discussion by the means of tyrants. I cause demons to be worshipped alongside men. I, I arouse desire in Quadash men. I see that priest. So the devil also has priests. The devil can tempt righteous people. If you have the rock or death, the devil can still tempt you. Alright. He got his own prophets, the prophet of Baal, the prophet of the law. So you watch the animal that say law, they worship and they are working on the devil. I, I bring about jealousies and murder in your country. I instigate wars. The mighty of war, the God of war is God got you all. Then I said to him, bring to me the one you said. It's been nurtured in the rest of which Azizu abandoned or abandoned. He, res he resulted, I will bring no one back to you. But there will come a certain demon whose name is Ephet Pass, who will bind him and bring him up out of the abyss. So the rest is the abyss. I responded, Tell me what, tell me why is he in the abyss of the rest sea and what is his name? I put it yet one that the phone doesn't go off so everything is not loose. Yeah, yeah. However, say, do not ask me. You are, you are unable to learn that from me. He will come to you because I too am with you. So, what the devil go? Saying, Father, saying the devil that two angels that, that work together. All right. Prior, go be with the description. The devil is prior. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Who's your name?